What is up everyone, it's Anthrop here and welcome back to another video. I know I'm not in my usual intro uh, spot, I'm not feeling quite well, so I was like, you know what, today we're just going to go straight into the new Pokemon set, Cosmic Eclipse. In my previous video, I opened up eight of these packs early and got some amazing pulls and hopefully we can replicate that in today's booster box where we get 36 packs. So as you can see from the front of the box, we've got a brand new triple tag team card being Arceus, Palkia and Dialga GX. And its alternative art looks incredible. It's a statue version of all three of those. And I think it's just, it's just such a perfect card. It's such a good follow up from the nice uh, stained glass Birds trio we got and on the top we've also got another tag team we don't get a um a statue of those three but we've got a baby pokemon tag team of clefa togepi and iglybuff it's quite random but i absolutely love it uh we've also got a piplup and blastoise tag team soul galio and lunala tag team and what isn't shown on the box we've got also another charizard and Brakeson uh tag team combo well it's not another Charizard breaks them but it's a Charizard tag team nevertheless we've got our silver pen back uh we're not losing him I've been keeping him safe so it's gonna help me generate some some luck into this box hopefully and uh, I'm just really excited it's been a while I feel like it's been uh, when I say it's been a while it's been three months but it just feels a bit longer since I opened up an English booster box. So we've got our 36 packs. Oh, it's so satisfying to open up 36 packs. I love doing it. Before we start opening up these packs though, let me know in the comments below which side you think is going to win. Will it be the left side or will it be the right side? And if you guess it right, I will pick one of you and you will win a free Cosmic Eclipse booster pack so yeah that'll be a little bit of fun maybe i would start doing this more if you guys like this sort of stuff i don't i don't really mind so we're gonna start opening these anyway shut up Robert. get into the packs okay i hear you guys <laughs> all right so we'll start with the left side first we've got a blastoise and piplop we've had some incredible first pack luck lately so hopefully we can continue going with it with this uh box so uh oh okay so packs cards there code card Okay, so we've got that right. So the co-card is facing this way. It's always it's always different. Pokemon are never consistent, so I'm very uh, very weary of it, especially for the first pack of cards. But hopefully we can get something good. So we've got Nose Pass looking. Oh, that's the Dialga. So the Statue Trio card actually all have their own statues in the background. So that's it's a very nice touch. Uh, I'm very excited for this. That's a really cute Rockruff. Um, very excited for the step, 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 step. We've got Arceus in the background there with the Teddy Ursula. There's a lot of playable cards. So I'll make sure to tell you guys all the playable cards, all the ones you should be keeping. So uh, stick around for that. We've got Quicker Tomb with the super long text. Improv <laughs> improvisational performance. It basically just does different things depending on how many cards you've got in your hand. It's absolutely crazy. I don't think it's overly good though. Great Catcher Reverse in our first pack. That is a very good card to get. It's definitely worth like, I think like maybe three pounds, maybe even four pounds. So that is such a good card. It basically lets you switch one of your opponent's bench Pokemon GX or EX with their active Pokemon but you have to discard two cards from your hand first. There's a lot of discarding from your hand abilities now, uh, especially in this set. So um, very good card. Keep four of those if you get them. And a Marshadow whispering behind Pikachu. Very disturbing. <laughs> very. Uh, I need to remember always to go from the left side as well. I've got a feeling I'm going to just take one from the right, but I'm going to try and avoid doing that. Oh, uh, co card. One, two, three, four. Four water, <laughs> water energy, one two. So I, I guess that will count as first pack luck since we got a. It, it was a good card. It's like worth more than some GXs, I think. The um, uh, the great catcher. So we've got Golette, Dupider, Apom, Great Catcher again. Wow. That is some good luck. Hopefully we can get a couple of those. I'm thinking you only get like one or two a box. And to get a reverse is like a cherry on top. Put that to the side. Dragonium Z. Destructive Drake. GX. 80 times. This card. All basic energy from this Pokemon. This attack does 80 damage for each card you discard this way. That's not too bad. But it can only be attached to Pokemon with the Dragon Claw attack. Could be quite good actually. Dust Clops. Rubat. Reverse with its nasal suction. That sounds disgusting. It's, it sucks your nasals. Ugh. And the Kamamo, Kamamo, 
Hello. Come on, Mama O. Hello. Very nice card. I really like that artwork. I really like it. It actually looks quite realistic. It kind of looks like it's from like Monster Hunter or something. And it would be very suitable since it's a it's a hollow. So I'll put that to the side. So so far I'm quite happy with those two packs. Even though we haven't got a GX, we definitely got a, a GX value. Um, co card. One, two, three, four. Fire lit energy. Will this be a lit pack though? Let's find out. Stuffle. Pawniard, Litleo, Coughing, Snow Want in the cold. There's a little snow Pikachu. That's really, really cute. Herdia, Tangrowth, Primplup, Lillipup reverse. Very cute card. Baby doe eyes. Oh, we got a rainbow right off the bat. We've got some Valley GX, and that is such. Oh, my hands are really sweaty. My my hands actually caused water damage onto my card in my last video. I kid you not. Let's sleeve that up ASAP. Oh God, that's not moving it. Oh, that centering is so nice as well. That that is such a beautiful card. Oh, it's really annoying because I want to show you the texture of the card, but if it's in the sleeve, but I don't want to ruin the card at the same time. Oh, wow. That is definitely one of the better rainbows to get. There's like rubbish ones like Wishy Washy and Oikurio, but Sylvani GX is very playable. I love how Gladion is just with him. There's such a nice card. It's got the ability disc reload. Once during your turn before your attack, you may draw cards until you have five cards in your hand. Absolutely amazing. Draw ability Pokemon cards have always been good. Zip Strike has been good. Zero Aura GX is amazing. Well, was amazing. So this is going to be super playable. It's got an attack called Brave Buddies. There's 50 plus damage if you played a supporter card from your hand during this turn, which you do in basically every turn of Pokemon. It does 70 more damage. So it's doing 120 for two colorless energies. And then it's got a GX attack, Silver Knight GX. If you oppose that to Pokemon as an Ultra Beast, it is knocked out. Out. So now we've got Ultra Beast tag teams. If people play an Ultra Beast tag team, you're just like Sylvani GX. That's three prizes. Nice and easy. What a nice start. We'll put that on the left side by the red magic cup. <laughs> the red magic cup Pikachu thing. Oh, whoever's picked the left side, it's looking quite good for you guys. And if it's a draw, I will decide. If it's somehow a draw, I guess. If that's like the only card I get on that side, and there's more on the other side. Yeah. Uh, uh, we'll, we'll sort something out. <laughs> it's like make up the rules as we go along. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Right, so one, two, three, four. That fire pack was lit in D. Wow. I think the only other better like rainbow rares was probably like the uh, the Reshiram and Zekrom uh, tag team GX and the Charizard and Brakeson. So very nice. Piplup, Flabebe, Sphil, the spherical seal, Natu. Jangmao, Island Challenge Amulet. Um, you can keep a couple of these, but yeah, just don't get rid of them all. Maybe just keep one, or maybe keep two or three of them. Another Erica's card. Each player may draw up to three cards. You draw, you draw first. Uh, I guess it's a good way to maybe deck out your opponent if you can, but it's not better than the other Erica, I don't think. Jolteon, reverse. Very cool. The attacks of your Pokemon GX are playing that evolve from EV. Cost one colorless less. You can't apply more than one speed cheer ability at a time. I think uh, we're going to see some really cool EV decks coming out uh, because all the evolutions now have these cool uh, abilities that help <laughs> the evolutions. At a Helio list, which is a normal type, which is very odd to see because it's actually a lightning type. Um, these are really nice cards, really nice artwork, and um, this pack is really hard to open. So, uh, oh, oh, that was a bit of a spoiler. So we've got a white code card, so it's going to be a hollow or better for those who still haven't learnt. If you get a white code card, um, <laughs> brain work. If you get a white code card, it means you're getting a hollow or better. Uh, Persimian, but it doesn't really matter if you don't get a white code card in this set because you've got these reverse supporter cards, these, well, reverse support uh, trainer cards with their Pokemon, and they come in the reverse holo slot. And then we've got the last uh, statue in the background, Palkia. So we've got them all. We've got a cool Pikachu, a very scary Love Vesta. Looks like it's set the whole forest on fire. Floette, Roxy, Phantom, reverse, and a Rosa. Hello, 
Wow, that's very nice. She has such a nice full art card. Uh, we got it in the pre-release. I bought a pre-release box for Rebecca. Trust her luck. She got the Rosa full art. So we've got one of those. However, I wouldn't mind another one. You can only play this card if one of your Pokemon was knocked out during your opponent's last turn. Search your deck for a Pokemon, a trainer card, and a basic energy. Reveal them and put them into your hand. It's very good because you're playing single prize cards. Uh, and they'll probably get knocked out turn after turn. And you can also use these for evolution. So you can get an evolution Pokemon. You can get a rare candy. And you can get an energy for that Pokemon so we might see the return of stage 2 Pokemon and Red Candy could be a very good but to get as a hollow that is very nice and it's probably worth a few crit so not bad at all very good hollow to get I should really speed this up I feel like I've been really slow but I think I, I like explaining as well what cards do so I hope you guys don't mind <laughs> I hope you guys don't mind and are enjoying this so far um, Metal Energy 1-2 Hopefully we can get some more, more bleh, hopefully we get some more uh, full arts. I want more full arts. I once got two rainbows in the box in my Burning Shadows box. I've got a Muck and a Dark Light GX. So hopefully we can get another rainbow. That would be sweet to pull that on camera. Red and blue tag team. Now that would be sweet to get as the full art for the set. Very good cards. Very good. The tag team cards, supporter cards are absolutely amazing. Keep four of every tag team supporter card. I think each of them will be playable at some point. Like super, super playable. This one lets you search your deck for a Pokemon GX that evolves from one of your Pokemon. Put it into, onto that Pokemon to evolve it. And then you can shuffle your deck. But if you play this card, you may discard two other cards from your hand. If you do search your deck for up to two basic energy cards and attach them to that new uh, to attach them to that Pokemon you evolved. So you can get a Weevil GX, which came out in Unified Minds, evolve it from your Sneasel, and then get two uh, Dark Energy, and you can basically start attacking with Dark Light and Umbreon uh, GX on that very turn. So, very, very good card. Uh, Chaotic Swell is also a good stadium keep, four of those. We've got Type Null to evolve into that Sylvani. We've got our first reverse trainer and Pokemon card. We've got Steelix. Um, oh, what's her name? That's Janine. I think it's Janine. Yeah, it's Janine. Because <laughs> she's the Metal Gym leader. Right, very, very cool card. Very nice looking. I really like how they've done Steelix. He does look giant, metal, and menacing. Very nice card to get. We're going to put it in a sleeve because you get. I think you get four of them a box. I think you're guaranteed four of them a box. Uh, we're just going to put it on the side there. No, so we've got a Macargo regular rare. Um, but there are some nice ones you get. You can get like an Acerola one, and you can get the uh, Red and Pikachu. Uh, well, Acerola and Mimikyu. So hopefully we can get the Red and Pikachu one. That'll be a very nice one to get. Uh, one, two, three, four. We've got rid of the Dark Energy. Uh, there's, ton there's just tons of cards in the set. This is the biggest set Pokemon have ever released. Uh, there's like, what, 272 or 71? Something like It's just something ridiculous. If you're a collector, I do feel sorry for you. Um, Trapinch, Spill, Cosmorium, Relaxing. We've got Mora, and then we've got the Jigglypuff and Lopunny in the background. So once again, with the tag team cards, since they're released, they do the tag team Pokemon in the backgrounds of other cards. It's just a nice little touch. Uh, Dust Clops, Welma, Reverse. Nice little reverse there. And a Togepi, Clefa, and Igglybuff. Tag Team GX. And that is actually a really, really good card to get. It's got the Attack Rolling Panic. It's a very funny name. Flip a coin until you get Tails. This attack does 30 more damage for each head. So... You've got 50-50 chance of it going for 150 damage. You've got 25% chance of 180, etc, etc. I do not know the, the, the other percentages, <laughs> so I'm not going to bother. But the cool thing about this card is GX Attack Supreme Puff <laughs> GX. For two Psychic Energy, take another turn after this one. Skip the turn between turn step. If this Pokemon has at least 14 extra energy attached to it, in addition to this attack cost, so if it's got 16 and uh, 16 fairy energy in total your opponent shuffles all of their bench pokemon and all cards attached to it into their deck so your opponent shuffles everything except for the active pokemon so you can make them skip their turn and then if you key you can ko them the next turn and win the game a very crazy attack i can't wait to see what people can come up with with that so we'll put that in a sleeve it has a really nice alternative art which we, we're kind of hoping to get as well so oh um the alternative arts in this set are 
by far probably the best alternative arts I've seen in just in a set in general that you can get from packs. So uh, hopefully get the Diago one. I'll be happy with that as one. Well. Even uh, Low Punny and Jigglypuff. Uh, just any, any really. Uh, one, two. We get the Charizard and Brakeson and the Venusaur and Snivy ones though in a box set coming out in a couple of weeks. So make sure you're subscribed and you'll be able to check that out hopefully. Uh, Lola Meowth. Just enjoying the scenery. Persimium, Routes, Jangmao, Pikachu, Anarif, Gloom, Lana's Fishing World, shuffle a Pokemon and a tool card from your discard pile into your deck. That's not too bad actually. Getting back tools is very good. Island Challenge Amulet Reverse. Always nice to get reverse trainers. And a, a muck. It's just <laughs> I saw some funny memes with this muck. He just looks so unimpressed. It's just like you're looking in garbage. <laughs> I think the meme I saw was when your mum catches you playing your DS under your under your pillow. I don't know, it just it just has that look. It's just it's just got Okay, it's funny to me. <laughs> it's like it's like it's just I'm not, I'm not it's like you guys aren't laughing, but I'm having the time of my life. <laughs> Let me have it. <laughs> oh we got our first other outlet, but first give you guys the code one, two, three, four. Fairy energy. Uh one, two. <laughs> I'm still laughing about the mark. So we got our first uh different rowlet. Looks really nice. We've got Phantoms, Grimer, Magnemite, Eevee. I think that's the first Eevee we pulled today. A Rackronid, Throw, Dartrix, Cynthia, and Caitlyn reverse. That's a nice tag team reverse to get. Put a supporter card from your discard pile into your hand. You can't choose Cynthia and Caitlyn or a card you discarded with the effect of this card. When you play this card, you may discard another card from your hand if you do draw three cards. It's a pretty good card. I think it'll be very good in uh, stool decks. But to get back supporters as well, if you're playing a one-off supporter and you want to get it back, it's kind of like a proxy VS Seeker in a way, but you can't obviously use that supporter that turn unless you use Lieutenant Social Strategy that lets you use two other supporters that turn. And we get a Sylveon. That is really, really cute. I'm actually going to put that Sympathy and Caitlyn on the side because I'm pretty sure that's worth about maybe £2 as well. You get a lot of expensive reverse cards in this set, so it's a very good set to get that was a hard pack to open maybe it's protecting it's uh oh that's not energy protecting us from uh well protecting itself from us <laughs> so right let's see what we can get we got a dust girl we haven't Actually, well, I was going to say, we haven't pulled a GX for a while, but it was a Togepi. That was going to be a complete lie. Ponyta, that is very detailed. That looks like it's come out from Breath of the Wild. Crabula, Bishop, Torco, Gloom, Reverse, Cosmog. Look how happy that Cosmog is. Very happy. Ooh, that's weird. That was upside down. But we've got another Bernard. Whoever picked the, the packs on the left, it's looking very, very good. We've got a Nagadadel and Guzzlord full up. Very, very nice. This is the craziest thing. On my pre-release, I pulled the Rainbow Rare. In my previous video, I pulled the Alternative Art. Sorry for spoilers, but I did get something else as well. So go watch that video if you haven't already. <laughs> and then in this one, I pulled the Full Art. So now all I need is the regular art. I've already completed the uh, Naganadel and Guzzlord. This is such a good and terrifying card. It's got an ability called Violent Appetite. Uh, if you discard a Pokemon card from your hand, you can heal 60 damage from this Pokemon. Very nice and simple. It eats other Pokemon. Absolutely terrifying to heal, heal itself. It's got 280 HP, so very good. Uh, it's got 180 damage attack for a Psychic, Dark, and Colorless. And then it's GX attack, Chaotic Order GX for Colorless. Turn all your prize cards face up, but here's the kicker. If you've got a Dark and Psychic attached to it, you can just take two prize cards. So you, all game, you can just take four prize cards, put this bad boy out, maybe use it with Malamar to get two energy, Psychic energy onto it very quickly, and then just be like, yeah, I'll use my GX attack. That's a free two prizes. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. This could be a god box. And I'm really hoping it is. So that's so far three GXs off the left side, including a rainbow. And I'm so happy I haven't like hit like a wishy-washy at the moment. Because it's just like, you don't want wishy-washy. You don't really want a Wikorio. You don't really want a Lowland Persian. We don't want those ones. We want, oh, it's a green code. But we can still get a nice reverse trainer card Pokemon thing. <laughs> uh, fire energy um so it's been very fortunate we've got the uh, good gx's at the moment let's hopefully keep it up chinchow cosmog 
Pancham, Drill Bird, Tangela, Mallow, and Lana. Once again, tag team supporter, very nice to get. When you play this card, you may... Oh, wait, well, switch your active Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon. That's its first effect. And when you play this card, you may discard two cards from your hand. If you do, heal 120 from the Pokemon you move to the bench. So, once again, it can be probably used in stool uh, decks, but it could be used in any decks. Like, you can t potentially heal 180 damage off that Naganadel from uh, the previous turn if someone did a lot of damage. So, it's not too bad. Uh, Tropius. Mimikyu hides it behind the tree. So there's two Mimikyus in this set. Oh, technically there's three because there's a full art one with uh, Acerola, I said. Lily's Pokedoll reverse. A nice reverse to get. Might be playable. This card can't retreat. If this card is knocked out, your opponent can't take any prizes. So basically, it acts as a as a Pokemon, really. And your opponent can't take a prize. So once again, be used in stool decks. And a Sunflora. I feel like I've not seen a Sunflora in so long. I kind of forgot that Pokemon existed. I just feel like it's been such a long time. Oh, we've got a Togga Damaru. Another... Actually, no, they love printing Togga Damarus. What am I talking about? Grass Energy. One, two. So we've got a Togga Damaru. Trapinch. Flabebe. Tangela. Time... Time pole with the stitching like that. Clay. Just got the top seven cards of your deck. If any of those cards are item cards, put them into your hand. It's kind of like... Um, What's his name? Her name? Hapu. Just called him a he. <laughs> it's kind of like Hapu, but with seven cards instead of six. And you can pick as many item cards and not just two. Oh, well, I guess Hapu lets you choose any two cards, so it's nothing like Hapu. <laughs> just like, it's just like backtrack on everything there. We've got a Glalie. Reverse. Ice Fang, 30 damage. Yeah, nothing special. Oh, and a Flygon GX. Wow, four GXs so far on the left side. And we still got... We still got six packs to go on that left side. I feel like I should just like, you know what, end this video here. <laughs> just like, take my losses and I just just stop here. Uh, Flygon GX, Dusty Defense, as long as this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, all of your, opponent, all of your Pokemon take 30 less damage from your opponent's attacks. Uh, uh. Desert Hurricane, 120 plus damage. If there's any Stadium card this, in play, this card does 120 more damage than this card, that Stadium card. So for three fighting energy, do 240 damage for the Stadium card. It's not too bad. And then another three fighting energy. Sonic Edge GX, 220 damage. This attacks damage isn't affected by any effects on your opponent's active Pokemon. It's an okay card. It's an okay card. I don't think it's playable at all at the moment. Definitely not at the moment. Not one of the better GXs to get, but uh, we, we can take those. It's a GX. We take it and things. Some people only get like one GX a box. Well, that's a, I've seen someone get like two GXs a box. I haven't seen anyone get one. One of my friends got one EX in their box a while back when the EXs were around. So I'm thankful for whatever I get. As long as it's not bad. <laughs> we got Wubat. You got Ducklet saluting, Swirlix, Alolan Grimer, Slugma, Gloom, uh, Celio, that's a thick Celio, Coughing Reverse with the uh, Blow Away Bomb, and a Fion. Oh, that's a really nice card. They do like printed Fions. I feel like I've seen them every, maybe every other set or every three sets. They do like printed Fions and Manaphys. Very cute Pokemon. Uh, code card. One, two, three, four. What well, cards do we want? We, we do want to get the Jigglypuff, though, and Lopunny. Um, we, we wouldn't mind getting a Charizard, though. Any of the artworks of the Charizard, we would like to get one full art supporter. That would be, that'd be like the cherry on top, I think. Just getting any of the full art supporters. In, maybe a tag team would be nice. Helioptal, Cosmog, Slugma, Welma, Pawniard, the Thick Helio, Draw Energy, that lets you draw an, uh, a card when you attach the energy. <laughs> <laughs> um, Cosmerium, a Magnemite, reverse with Lieutenant Surge. So we've got another reverse trainer card. Very nice. That Magnemite is very happy. Kind of like the uh, the face of Cosmomium and Cosmog they do. Very happy Magnemite. I really like uh, how Lieutenant Surge is just wiping off all the grease because he wanted to shine that Magnemite up. He loves his Pokemon. And then <laughs> and Ursaring doing the Kung Fu Panda pose. <laughs> <laughs> right, you got four of packs on the left side, and then hopefully, you never know, if you picked if you picked it on the right, it could still be good. I just realized, oh wow, that's a hard pack to open. I just realized you guys can just like change your comments and edit them or delete them or wait until the video is over. Hmm, I trust you guys though. You guys want a bit of fun. Then play by the rules. <laughs> I completely just realized how how you guys can just 
completely get around <laughs> that game. Well, I'll think of some other games, don't worry. Don't worry. See, I'm not just a pretty face. <laughs> Onyx, I think that's the first Onyx we've got. Welma, Cricketone, Apom, Clefairy, Dole Swap. Uh, put this Pokemon and all cards attached into your hand. If you do, you may play Lindy's Poke Doll from your hand as your new active Pokemon. That seems pretty cool. Could do some stalling with that. Uh, Pig Knight, Zangus, I think that's the first Zangus we've got. We've got a Spill Reverse and a Water Type Revolve. Very cool. I don't think I've seen a Water Type Revolve Pokemon card before. Correct me if I'm wrong. If, if I'm ever wrong, always correct me. I like being corrected. I will put you on the list though, but <laughs> correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> one, two, three, four. Psychic Energy, one. Two. I wonder if we can finish this left side off on a bang at some point within these last three packs. Drillbur, Swirlix, Cricketot, Ducklet, Rubat, Unidentified Fossil, Hakama O, Herdier, Reverse Wolverine uh, Rare, not bad, it's always nice to get a Reverse Rare card, and a Slurpuff, Olfactory Enchantment, Olfactory, I can't actually pronounce that word, Olfactory, Olfactory, it's Slurpuff. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I need to say. It's Slurpuff. Right. Oh my god. I'm just These packs are very, very tight. Uh, <laughs> BTC, Bitcoin. <laughs> Actually, I do collect co-cards. Funny enough, I do collect co-cards with uh, funny, funny, uh, just like, initials? Initials? What's it, what's it when it's shortened a word? The point is, I collect funny co-cards. <laughs> I might show you guys the collection one day. I did the energy already. I think so, yeah. Get distracted way too easily. Dua, Pida, Helioptile, Carvana, Togedamaru, Tepig, really cute, sleeping on the pillow, Island Challenge, Amulet, Curlia, Roller Skater has a really nice full art, so hopefully uh, that would be nice to get. Alolan, Sanshru, Reverse, and a Weezing, it also has Blow Away Bomb. I don't think a Pokemon has ever had the same ability on its basic and stage one. I, d I don't think I've ever seen that, that's awesome. Uh, last pack on the left side. So one, two, three, four. Grass energy. One, two. Let's see if there's anything else. I, I highly doubt it. It's just been such an insane half. Tepe. A uh, Lunar Sanctuary. Snow one. Coughing. Misty and Lorelei. Lorelei? Lorelei? I don't know. Search your deck for up to three water energy cards, reveal them, put them into your hand, and shuffle your deck. When you play this card, you may discard five other cards from your hand. If you do during this turn, your water Pokemon can use their GX attacks, even if you use your GX attack. Whoa! I actually didn't even know what that did. That is crazy. So your water Pokemon can use their GX attacks again. I'm going to have to look at all the water Pokemon GX attacks. That seems very, very strong and a very cool card. So... Not bad. Professor Oak setup. This is a very good card. Definitely keep four of those. Search your deck for up to three basic Pokemon of different types and put them onto your bench and shuffle your deck. It's kind of like the old uh, Bridget. Um, they let you get three basic Pokemon. Now it's three Pokemon of different types, but it's still a very good card. Uh, we'll see that a lot. We'll definitely see that a lot in the future. Uh, Rotom Reverse and the other Mimikyu made out of clay. Ah, a very nice ending for that half. So now on to the other half. We'll put those just on the side there. Actually, you know what? There we go. So it's not like blinding you. I don't want to blind you guys. I don't want to blind you. <laughs> oh God. Hey, you know what? This is a put them. This is a put them flat down. There you go. Nice and easy. Uh, wow. There's just like a whole landslide of Pokemon cards going here. That's the fun thing about Open the Box. You just get a whole landslide of Pokemon cards to tidy up afterwards. Is that really the fun part? It actually yeah, it is the fun part. I love tidying up Pokemon cards. I just hate sorting them out. I love tidying them up. I hate sorting them out. I've just got so many cards. I, mean, I don't want to think about it. Rubat, <laughs> Douglet, Helioptile, Cosmog, Slugma, Will. Next time you flip any number of coins for the effect of an attack, ability, or trainer card this time, choose heads or tails for the first coin flip. Wow, that's pretty good. Is that for... That's for anything, ability, trainer card. So you can guarantee, like, heads on super scoop-ups. And uh, there's that slow poke and side duck tag team that lets you flip coins for its GX attack and you do, like, 100 more damage for each head. So you can guarantee a head. So that's very, very good. Uh, I, I'm quite interested to see how much play that will get. Mimikyu, a beast type, very good. It's good for Ultra Beast. It does 10 more damage for each uh, prize card you've taken. 
basically. The attacks of the Ultra Beast, this card is attached, you do 10 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon for each price. That's exactly what I said. Well done, Robert. <laughs> I know Pokemon. Trapinch and a Steelix. Hello. Oh, that's a nice start. So we're having a very similar start where we got, I think, a Rosa on the second pack. So... Um, nice, I don't think it's good. Flip a coin until you get Tails attack, does 100 damage for each head, so you can guarantee with... Where's Will gone? There you go, with Will you can guarantee at least 100 damage. Nice, nice, nice cool hollow to get. So, that's a hollow so far. Do, do I count that? Actually, no, I don't think... I think hollows might be kickers. We'll see. I'm, I'm still, like, decided if we're going to go through this pack thing because I realise you guys can cheat. But I, 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 you guys are honest viewers. I, I trust every single one of you. So I know none of you would cheat. And you want to be a part of the fun. So thank you. That's what I'm saying thank you for. <laughs> right. we got the Lonely Grimer. Slugma. Chinchow. Cosmog. Pancham. I think being under these lights just gets... The heat gets into my head. Uh, Cynthia and Caitlin again. Yeah, it was again. So I got it in reverse before. Unidentified Fossil. Rapidash. Nice realistic artwork. Can't wait to see a uh, Rapid Dash. That's going to look so cool. I'm so excited. Uh, Alone and Nine Tails. Oh, did I say Alone? I mean Galar, Galarian. Uh, Rapid Dash, because we've seen a Gal Galarian Ponyta. So you've got Alone and Nine Tails, Rubbish <laughs> Blizzard. This attack does 10 damage for each Pokemon tool card in your discard. Discard par. I think it's also a little like nudge towards uh, pollution and stuff. So good on you, Pokemon. And the last card is a Mega Low Punny and Jigglypuff GX. I said I wanted that GX card. Oh, I'm well happy. I actually pulled that in my uh, Japanese booster box. So, oh, that is beautiful. I get to see what it finally does. So it's got 240 HP. I know it's been in winning decks, but I'm actually not quite sure what it does. Oh, man. Uh, jumping Balloon, 60 plus damage. This attack does 60 more damage for each of your opponent's GX and Pokemon EX in play. So that's not bad. That can definitely do a lot of damage. 5, 6. It can do 360 damage to be exact. Uh, so it's quite be, be quite good against uh, Raichu... Uh, Lonely Raichu and Pikachu and Zekrom decks because they play a lot of GX Pokemon. And then it's got a GX attack called Puffy Smashers. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now asleep. This Pokemon has at least four extra energy attached to it in addition to this attack's cost. This attack does 200 damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. So that is... <laughs> I've got a red and flustered. So that's very good. You can leave your opponent's active Pokemon asleep. It can have a 50-50 chance or 100% chance to remain asleep, I think. No, will won't affect it. It's on your opponent's turn because they flip it. But um, it's got a 50 50 chance, and you can just knock out like a detonating GX very easily. Sniping uh, Pokemon has always been good. So, so that's a good card to get. So maybe the right side will fight back. This could be a really good God Box. Uh, we'll put that, we'll just like scoop over some cards. They're just gonna, they're just falling everywhere. <laughs> it's such a mess. I need to find a way to make this neater. There we go. Right, on to, I have two packs in. That's a very, very similar start, actually. Two packs in. Got a Hollow and a GX already. Let's see if we can keep this, uh, let's keep this up. Uh, fire Energy, very similar. When we got the Fire Lit Energy, we got the Rainbow Sil Valley. So let's see what we'll get. Snow One, Coughing, Swirlix. Go to the other side. Oh my God. Oh, there we go. There we go. Just scoop everything to the side. Worry about it afterwards. Clefairy. Uh, Ambipom, that's the first Ambipom with artwork. Golduck, Araquanid Reverse, and another Fion Rare. I don't think I've ever got a... Uh, I don't think I've ever got two of the same Rare inside the box before. That's odd. Considering how big the set is, it feels very unlikely that should have happened. I'm not, I don't really care, it's just a Rare card, but... Super weird. I guess that's a good thing if there's some good rare cards to get. You can get multiple of a rare card if it's like really, really good. Uh, Cricketot, Apom, Rubat, Ducklet, Swirlix, Dragonium Z again, Draw Energy, Squelp, Reverse, and an Entei. Ooh, I like that Entei. I like, uh, I like the Pokemon third movie with Entei, even though it was an Entei. Spoilers, but it's, it's like a 20 year old film. Well, it's not 20, it's like 15 years old, but uh, very good film. I definitely would recommend checking it out. Um, it's got Unknown in it as well. I don't know if Unknown, um, it's unknown to me <laughs> if uh, Unknown have appeared in any other Pokemon episodes or movie. So, uh, Apom, Onyx, Tepig, Alunus Andrew, Absol. I think it's the first Absol 
I've got an Asset Flareon Power Cheer ability. This is what we're talking about. The, the evolutions have really good abilities. Oh, I really love the artwork. Whoa, that's really cool. Okay, I was just really appreciating that. Um, the attacks of your Pokemon GX are paying that evolve from EVD 30 more damage your opponents add to Pokemon. You can't apply more than one power chair ability at a time. It's very, just very good. I think we're going to see some really cool uh, decks. Uh, Roller Skater. I think I see something in the back there. We've got a Dupai to reverse. What do we get? What do we get? Whoa, we got another. Whoa, we got another full art tag team. What? Whoa, that's like an insane box. Venusaur and Snivy Tag Team GX 270 HP. This is Venusaur's second uh, tag team card. Once during your turn, oh, it's got Shining Vine as the ability. Once during your turn, if this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, when you attach a Grass Energy from your hand to it, you may switch your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active Pokemon. That's actually pretty good uh, to get those uh, effects where you can switch your opponent's Pokemon. Very, very good. Uh, Forest Dump. I wonder if they made that attack to sound like Forest Gump. Hmm. Hmm, Pokemon. Hmm, 160 damage. And then it's GX attack, Solar Plant GX. This attack does 50 damage to each of your opponent's Pokemon. If this Pokemon has at least two extra energy attached to it in addition to its attack cost, heal all damage from all of your Pokemon. Wow! That's a massive upgrade. I'm pretty sure it's all GX attack did like 180 damage or something, or 200 damage, and it already healed from him, so... That's pretty good. It's only colorless energy. It's quite weird how it doesn't actually use too many grass energy, uh, considering it's too... Uh, grass Pokemon Venusaur being super beefy. So, wow. I'm very spooked right now. That's like six GXs in this box so far. And we've still got, I think, like, I think we've got like 13 packs left, 14 packs. I don't know. No, not 14, maybe 12 or 11, but. These could be awful, but I've got a feeling that we're still in for something really big. I feel like this is just going to be the good box. Carvana, Onyx, Tokutamaru, Welma, Palpito, Pangoro, Heracross, Lilies, Pokedel, Herdia, Reverse, and a Alolan Sandslash with Metal. A metal type, because I think the one we got previously was a Water type. Gonna try and go through these a little bit quicker now. I think I've spoken about most of the cards that I want. I uh, think there's still another card. There's a card I want to get called Tag Cool. That's another very good uh, trainer card that lets you get two GX Pokemon from your deck and put them into your hand. So hopefully we can get one or two of those still. Uh, Natu, Palpito, Jamo, Deerling, Golet, Guzma, and Hala Tag Team. Uh, Supporter. Search your deck for a stadium card, reveal it and put it in your hand, then shuffle your deck. Very good, you can get the uh, Prism Stadiums out a bit easier, I guess kind of like Lycia. And then when you play this card, you may discard two other cards from your hand. If you do, you may also search your deck, oh, well, your deck for a Pokemon Tool card and a special energy card this way. So, oh, that was out of focus. Sorry about that. Um, it's not bad. Keep four of those. Keep four of all your tag team supporters. Talking to Maru, Gallade. Reverse with Wally sitting right next to it. A very nice, simple artwork. Very, very cute cute cards. I really like it. It's got the ability double type as long as this Pokemon card is in play. It's Psychic and Fighting type. I feel like they've done that before with an older uh, card. And then we've got a Crabominable regular rare. I actually like that artwork. I, I really like that artwork for a Crabominable. It's like I hate Crabominable. They make their artwork really bad and it's just an ugly Pokemon but I do like that one. I think we've got like what? I don't know, 10 packs left? One, two, three, yeah. I think it's got 10 or 11 left. So uh, here's the code card. We still need to get an alternative art. <laughs> I say that, says the guy with two full art supporters and a rainbow rare. But we, we do want an alternative art. And we still want a full art supporter card. So I'm not greedy at all. <laughs> Go there. Jupiter, Helioptile, Tepig, Igly, Buff. Very cute. Will, Golduck, Kyogre, Reverse. Very nice artwork. You get Kyogre and Groudon in this set. And the last card is a Golurk. I should really learn to bring up a... a re, uh, bleh, bleh. See, this is what I'm talking about. I was, I was going to say, I really should learn to bring up a drink when opening up packs. Because it is it makes my mouth super, super dry. Um, and it's just with all these lights. One, two, three, four, one, two. Uh, up that way. Teddy Ursula. Nuj Pass. We haven't had the Probo Pass. Or a Probo... Robo pass. Okay, maybe not. Tackle! That's the card we wanted. So let's you get two tag team Pokemon cards and put them into your hand. Good card to get. Keep four of those, obviously. Chaotic Swap, that's the second one we've got. Cosmog Reverse. 
and a Swordsbuck Hollow. I feel like we have not seen that card in a very long time. I think since the original X and Y sets were released. So quite a nice random uh, card to get. So we've got another Hollow. Have we got, I think we've not really got like three Hollows. We've got the Rosa Steelix that. Oh, and we got the uh, Kumamoto at the beginning, the very first pack. Uh, so that's four. Normally we get what, between six and eight Hollows a box. So uh, we've got four. I'll, I'll definitely take more GXs though. I think sometimes when you get less hollows, you get more GXs, but I'm not quite sure. And sometimes if you get less GXs, you get more hollows. I feel like they fill it up somehow like that. Uh, Lillipop, Trapinch, Sneasel, Spill, Lilies, Full Force. That looks incredible as the full up. We want to get that. Ends Resolve is another great card. Just kind of top card, six cards on your deck. If any of those cards are basic energy cards, attach uh, them to one of your bench dragon Pokemon. There's a really good card, Reshiram and Zekrom Tag Team GX. And it's a dragon type and you, you just want to put it all on those. And it also works with that uh, Naganadal and Guzzlord card as well. So you can just power that up very quickly. Um, a Lonan Meowth Reverse and an Oricorio GX. So we've got our GX number seven, I believe. Uh, Dance of Tribute. So let's see why I think this card is bad. Uh, once during your turn before you attack with any of your Pokemon knocked out during your opponent's last turn, you may I'm actually die. I'm so ill at the moment. I don't know how I survived this long. <laughs> Sorry about that. You may draw three cards. You can't use more than one Dance Tribute ability each turn. It's actually not a bad ability. I guess you can have one sitting on the bench in any deck and you can just draw uh, three cards and any of your Pokemon are knocked out. I guess it's actually not as bad as I thought. It's also got an attack of Razor Ring and Strafe GX, which is Pokemon of your bench Pokemon. It's not like an attacking Pokemon. It's one of those support Pokemon like Dedene uh, GX. You don't use it really to attack. You just use it for its good ability, which lets you draw, well, discard your whole hand and draw six cards. Um, so I guess, okay, I, I was wrong. Ori Koryo, you're not too bad. You're not as bad as I thought. I'm sorry for slandering your name. Um, Grass Energy 1 2. God, can we get number 8? Can we get an 8th Ultra Rare in this box? Oh my god, I feel like this, this is like one of the best boxes I've ever had. I feel like I've said that in the last video or something as well. It's just crazy. Cottony, Rotom, Type Null, Heracross, Pyro, Reverse. Very nice reverse. You can actually feel the fire, you can feel the heat, and a Swanner. Okay, so these are the last. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven packs left. Surely there must be one more thing. Seven packs. Surely, surely not though. <laughs> oh, spoilers with the dart tricks. Uh, one, two, three, four. Water energy. One, two. Surely. <laughs> it's quite nervy just thinking about it. It's really nervy and exciting. That's a really cute alone Vulpix, and I feel like it's the first duffel I've seen in this box. It just goes by so quickly. Um, oh, what? I didn't even know we got that card. Belaba, Belelba, and Bryson Man. I have no. Is there any from like Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon? I haven't really played that game at all. Discard three cards from the top of each player's deck. Very good, actually, for stool decks to stop them from like getting you into a stool loop. And when you play this card, you may discard three other cards from your hand. If you do, each player discards a bench Pokemon until they have three bench Pokemon. Your opponent discards first. That is very good. I think you also use it in stool decks to make your opponent like lose quicker as well. I don't know, actually. Hmm, it does seem very good. Once again, though, keep four of those. Tackle again, so we've got another tackle. Very good. Dark Tricks, Soul, Galio Reverse. That's actually a really nice reverse. I really like that card. I like the uh, fire coming from around it. Very nice. And a Seismitoad. <laughs> it looks really weird. <laughs> it looks like it's just like a large Seismitoad like, about to destroy the world. This looks huge. Oh, okay, that was a tight pack. There must be something good in here. There must be something good in here. Right, let's go straight to it. Psychic Energy, one, two. That was very, very tight. <laughs> Ponyta, Breath of the Ponyta, Kavana, Chin Chow, Rufflet, Azumarill with the stitching, very nice. Igglypuff, Pyro, Hakamoto, Jamato, and. Oh, it was a Well Lord. <laughs> oh, you can go with my Well Lord plushie. Yay! <laughs> Heavy Impact 19, Hydra Splash 140, 200 HP for a Stage 1 non GX. Well, Lord is massive. Never mind about that theory then about tight packs equals better cards. That was just a Pokemon card theory. <laughs> 
better not get copyright by that. Uh, Psyduck, Trappage, Oddish, Rufflet, Piplup, Clay, Primplup, Beastite, Duskull, Reverse, and a Black Chirum Hollow. That looks really nice. Frozen Ring, 30 damage, discard special energy card, attach your opponent's to Pokemon. Eh, not great. Dazzling Blizzard, though, 100 plus damage for two water and two colorless energy. If you have any Steam card in play, this attack does 100 more damage. To be fair, 200 damage for a basic Pokemon. That is potentially really, really good. So, not bad. Not bad. Is it playable at the moment? Mm, no, <laughs> probably not. <laughs> There's probably a lot of better things. However, I think basic Pokemon are becoming more uh, playable because uh, they are just they're getting stronger. They are making basic uh, one prize Pokemon uh, stronger to keep up with the whole uh, tag teams and stuff. Uh, Time Pole, Duskull, Tangler. I need to take some medication after this. I need to take so much medication. Appropriately though. <laughs> My brother, Promo Pass. Yes. My brother, I pulled you. <laughs> I should grow a moustache. Whimsicott, reverse, actually a very good card. Who remembers the Lost March decks? Well, Lost March is back, but in fairy form. Uh, Lost March is basically every Pokemon you have in your Lost Zone, except for Prison Pokemon, or uh, it does 20 times the amount of damage, so more Lost March Pokemon. We've got even more Lost March Pokemon, so we've got two Whimsicott. Uh, very good actually because it's very type it does counter the upsurge of dragon Pokemon that we'll be seeing uh, from this set um, So yeah, very very good one two three four Fairy energy one two really good. Oh, it's only got oh really got three packs left This is the third of three So for baby a lone sand tree ponyta sunken cosmog throw Tangrove, Lily's Full Force, yes, the Acerola Mimikyu, yes, we wanted this and the Ash and Pikachu, well, Red and Pikachu, what a nice card to get, look how cute it is, and the eyes are hollow too, that is so, so nice, absolutely love this card, the only card that was missing from the set is the, the Lily and Clefairy promo that we got in Japan, so hopefully we can also get to here, I reckon it'll probably be released in some sort of special edition box. And then a Zachu regular rare. So we'll put that on the side. Wow, so we've got five hits on the other side. And we still got two packs left. There's still a chance to get like an alternative art. There's still a chance to get another regular GX. And there's also still a chance to get like a secret gold rare. There are nine, I think there's nine secret gold rares in this set. Or oh, seven, one of those. There's, there's a lot of secret gold rares. I think it was nine. So there's still a chance. Let's see if we can get it. Last two packs. Let's go. Welma, Pornia, Token Tamaru, Trapinch, Flabebe, Lilip, Jolteon of the Speed. Oh yeah, we saw that earlier. Pangoro ends resolve reversed, and a Dramper. So we've got one pack left. Can the right side bring it back with a gold ray? If, it did, if we did get a gold ray, it'll be very close to say which side was better. So let's have a look what we can get. One, two, three, four. Dark energy. One, two. Got a good feeling. No, I don't. I don't. Do I? Hmm. Julba. Do I have a feeling? Do I just say I've got a good feeling to hype things up? I probably did just now. I don't know. I'm not feeling it. We'll see. Duska. <laughs> Going all physical. Physic brain. All psycho. <laughs> Professor Oak set up. Good card. Pyro. Delmise. Reverse. And an Amaldo. So, yes, I was right on my. I was right with my heart. My brain was just like, go for it, Robert. Say it was going to be a good card at the end. But my heart was like, no. Just no. But wow. Wow. This is going to be a great recap. Let's let's take a look at it. So on the right side of the box, we've got Glade, Acerola, Oricorio GX, Megalopunny and Jigglypuff GX, and a Venusaur and Snivy Full Art Tag Team GX. And then you're like, wow, that's not bad. Wait until you see the other side. On the left side, we've got Steelix and Janine, uh, Lieutenant Surgeon Magnemite, Flygon GX, Togepi Cleffa and Igly Buff Tag Team GX, Naganadel and Gosnor GX. We've got two full art GXs. And then the cherry on top, the Sylvalli GX. 
absolutely amazing. I am so happy with this box. It's always scary buying the box. You see other people pull cards and you're just like, oh, it's going to be bad. You're going to get wishy-washy. <laughs> God damn it, I hate wishy-washy. Uh, uh, I'm so relieved it was such a good box. So that's the end of the video and what an amazing box that was. I hope you guys enjoyed it. The left side definitely won so if you chose the left side I'll be picking out a winner and you'll get a Cosmic Eclipse pack. Let me know in the comments below which were your favourite cards to be pulled and don't forget to like this video and if you're new here please feel free to subscribe and check out my other videos. Liking, commenting and subscribing really helps the channel out so thank you to everyone that does it in, uh, that does it? That's a really bad English Robert, that do it in all of my videos. I'll be opening up the Cosmic Eclipse Elite elite trainer box in my next video so i hope you look forward to that and i guess i'll hopefully see you guys there too so thank you again for watching and i'll see you next time god i do repeat myself a lot i'm gonna go